we can do. Oh, come on, I dodged that. Oh, I think I'm hitting two of them. Ouch. Okay. Ah, someone could curry. That's not good. All right, good. I think I'm hitting two of them again. This is awesome. Crap. Okay, we need to go ahead and make sure that Malak doesn't go down. Ah, I was trying to save him. I won't disgrace myself again. Oh my gosh, I can't believe she didn't die from that. There she goes. Okay. They're about to break again, though. Ah, oh, criminy! Yeah, it is getting serious here, Malik. Urgh, stop hitting me! Please stop hitting me! I 
wish you hadn't seen me like that. I don't like them having to use that now, but it's keeping them stun locked. Which is hopefully let them heal me! Oh my gosh! Really not a fan of that move you keep doing. Really not a fan. Oh, for a split second I thought I had five of them out. I wish there was someone to know how many of them were gone. Okay, stop hitting me! Man. No, Malak. Holy crap, they killed me fast. Oh my god, are you I didn't even have time to dodge. Okay, life bottle up Malik. Good. I'm glad someone got that off. No more came out. That's a good sign. Still no more have come out. That's a very good sign. Ow. Oh my gosh! Nope, bring him back up. I don't even care. I'm down to three. They're down to two. They're down to one. <sighs> the 
does not dodge that correctly. I think I'm still okay though. There we go. Man, that was like my first try today. So that feels pretty good. I'm glad I was able to beat him. Her. Them. Whatever. Bunch of levels up. So I disagree that I'm underleveled. Thank you very much. <laughs> Alright. Beautiful hipster? What? Man, she would hate being called that. There's no end to them. There better be an end to them. I can't do that again. Sophie, no. Come back. So we don't feel like you have to do this to save us. Come, child. We. All of us. You're the same person. We will ease your loneliness. Stay with us forever. An eternity without sadness. Eternity without sadness. Sophie, no! Humans. Don't. Oh, this is bad. Yeah, you think? Die. What? She turned into flower petals? What in the world is that? What? Okay. That would have been helpful to have before. It's Lambda. Lambda protected us? It certainly seems that way. Man, Lambda sure picks, like, makes us go through a lot of trials before he decides to come along and help. Land to also kill little queen? I mean, I don't know whether that was exactly death, but that was something. Apparently not. And what is Lambda, then? Lambda should be a way more of a child of Fodra than Sophie is. Come on, Sophie. Okay. It must be hard for Sophie to be like, oh yeah, you're the person I'm supposed to kill. Kinda. Alright, so which way did I come from? Kitty, not now. I think I came up into it from over there, so I think this is the way I haven't been yet. Yeah, I definitely don't remember coming up like this. And like I said, this is my first try, so I just came this way. Or, not this way, but I would theoretically be able to remember. I know what I'm saying, guys! Where am I going? Wait a minute, really? Was that there the whole time? Oh, that's frustrating. Well, the grant I would have had Excel mode if I had Is the shuttle fixed? gone that way, or not Excel mode, but you know the Mystic Break thing, whatever it's called. That's transhumanism of Lambda. What should we do now? I kind of want to check out the data I took from the lab. Then perhaps we should return to Telos as to. I think some rest will do us all a world of good. 
You must be tired too, right, Sophie? You should get some rest. Asbel? Asbel's not good at talking. Right. Uh, let's go back to tell us as to. Well, first of all, we're bloody well saving. I may have just done this. I want to make doubly sure I don't have to fight that again. Man. Not polite. So let's go ahead and allow Pascal to continue her studies. Should we examine the data first? There's probably a machine around here that can play it back. Are you thinking about what that girl said? I don't know if she's a girl. Don't be fooled by her words, Sophie. They were designed to lower your defenses. Hey, why don't you come rest with me? It's okay. I'm fine, but... Okay, but if you need anything, just ask. Alright. So there's a machine around here. Yeah, view the data. So yeah, before I forget... Man, I went through 13 life bottles. I'm a big spender. Nothing here? Nope. Okay. Um, I'm assuming that that is going to be upstairs with all the other machinery that lets me play stuff. Seems like a logical assumption to me. I gotta tell you guys, my new job is doing a number on me. Man. I'm having to think a whole lot more than I used to. I used to have kind of a dumb job that I... Why does this thing hate me, I swear? So, right there, for whatever reason, my mic just decided to stop working. And so, yep, clearly this is going to be recorded after the fact. Sorry about that, but it's better than having silence for the last, you know, 10 minutes of the episode, or 15 minutes of the episode, or however much we have left, I don't even know. But, yeah, as I was saying, uh, my new job is just really, really, really making me struggle. It's a lot more, it's just a lot more responsibility, a lot more stuff I have to do. So, sad face. Um, so things are slowing down a little bit. I mean, I my new computer is in the process of being manufactured right now. I'm expecting to have it in within the week. Hopefully that will help. That will make upload, you know, the actual rendering process take less time. Which is really good because my time to be at home is taking a lot more time. Uh, also lessening. I'm spending more time not at home, which means I have less time to record. It's just interesting. So, anyway... Uh, back to the actual subject of what we're doing. I didn't see anything in there, in the records room about the records, so I'm going to go back to where Emerald was, because she had a lot of computers around her. And that just seems to make sense to me. So, does it make sense to you guys? Um, I hope so, but even if it doesn't, that's what I'm doing. And you won't see it until I've already found out, so ha! Ha! Okay, hey, this looks like what it's supposed to be. Awesome. Where were you, Malik? How come you're lagging behind? The city appears safe for now. Well, I'm glad it does. Uh, you just went out there by yourself? We'll be hard-pressed if any more of those monsters show up. I don't think so. We can fight bigger things than them. Yes, and it's only a matter of time until they do. I'm concerned. If left unchecked, these creatures could wipe out all of Affinia, too. How would they get there? I mean, I suppose they could, yeah, but... Okay, that should do it. I still love Pascal's hat. <laughs> I've just got to say that. All members of the second research team have perished. Well, 
that's no good. They brought these samples back with their lives. We cannot let them go to waste. Samples of what? Very well. Proceed with the research. Are they setting up for another expansion of Ooh, and now the samples have gone evil. Probably not. The core's current structure is similar to that of an immune system. So there's a whole bunch of white blood cells in it? Trying to rid itself of a virus. And in this scenario, the virus is Yes, I'm afraid so. What? The little queen's target is none other than humanity itself. Oh, okay, that's why human the queen can make so many blood brothers of itself. Although, if the core is that of an immune system, um, most immune systems do not send white blood cells out into the world in order to eliminate virus at its source. That must be why the place is so dead. I call her Little Queen because she refers to herself in the Royal We. Even when there's only one of her. Now, if that was a surveillance monitor, how come it would be at all tilty? She didn't hit it. Please! Have mercy! Give us more time! We, we just want to live! Die, human. Well, wait, if. Then why is Fodra dead if they got killed before they shut down the core? Because Fodra was definitely dead. destroy humanity. That is the reason for which we exist. Okay, you're now talking to no one. Just saying. An elaborate cosplay. As far as I can tell, that all happened about a thousand years ago. Why did Fodra turn on them? Good question, but one that can wait. We have more pressing concerns right now. Right. We need to find a way to stop the little queens. That actually, um, that, that makes possible? sense. She must have, like, woken up when we came here the first time well, and is only really active now because we weren't here for very long. Whatever. That's what those scientists said in the video. But did they succeed? It seems that they were killed before they could act. Well, Fodra's core was shut down for almost a thousand years. They must have found a way. Hmm. Well, I kind of sort of have an idea. Uh-oh. But it involves Lambda. Interesting. If we have Lambda absorb the core's Aleth... But what would happen to Asbel? I would be unharmed, oh boy, bell room time. but I can't speak for you. If I absorb the core's elif, it will pass through both your mind and your body. Hmm. The strain would be too much for a fragile human to withstand. If anything were to go wrong, your body and mind would be completely obliterated. So are you saying that a fragile human would not be able to stand it, or that all humans are fragile. 
I, I love that verb because it could go any way. A fragile human could not, you know, it's it could be a statement of condemnation or just a statement of fact. Why didn't that happen to Richard? Richard's body and his mind were almost completely under my control. So a normal human can't handle the Elif, but you can. Is that right? What are you planning? Time. Lambda, I need a favor. You are not hearing me, human. This procedure will utterly destroy you. No, it won't. It's too dangerous to rely on Lambda. And even if we did, Asbel could be torn apart in the process. It's okay. I can do this. You mustn't. Don't be a fool. Think about what you're saying. I have. I'm going to let Lambda take over temporarily. What? You're going to voluntarily uh, let Lambda take control? That's madness! Um, Sophie is the one you should be talking to. She's the one that's going to be really, really, really weirded out by it. It's not madness, Captain. Don't do this! Lambda will absorb you, just as he did to me! If that happens, you won't be Asbel anymore. Guys, I'm just lending it to him. It's not permanent. And after I give up control, Lambda can absorb the Elith and seal it inside himself. Because Elith is only dangerous during the period where it's flowing. So Asbel's going to offer himself to Lambda for just that little bit of time. That would minimize well, the strain for sure. But... Won't absorbing all that Elith allow Lambda to become active again? That's a good point. Do you really believe Lambda will just hand your The real question is, is Lambda done? trustworthy? Yes, I do. Lambda so what this entire arc's been us. like leaning we towards. All saw it. So... And that's a good question. I mean, I do feel like he has learned the value of friendship and he's no longer alone. And I think he would be really sad if we all died. If he was willing to do that, Still. I'm willing to put my trust in him. Besides, we don't really have a choice. We have to shut down Fodra's core. There's no doubt that Ellis from the core is responsible for the new monsters around here. And I bet it's responsible for the monsters on Athenia, too. Asbel is correct. One way or another, we have to shut it down. So that's why Lambda and I have to try. What if it doesn't work? Then it what doesn't if work. It fails and you're not you anymore. Well, that would be a really lame ending of the game, and I doubt they'll do that. I'll be fine. How can you be so sure? I told Pragmatism. you I wanted to give Lambda a chance. I have to do this, Sharia, for a lot of reasons. So please, let me try. Well, it's not you that's trying, though, is the problem. Talk to Sophie. Good Look, lord, she's the one that's gonna look more than anything. But it's all we've got. Are you I mean, this is this is exactly what we're getting into with the little queen. Uh, the little queen's mission is to destroy right. humanity. Humanity I'll shows that she wants to destroy you. it. You wanna let Lambda it's out right next to Proto's Ace? No, probably not. He's been living with Lambda for like a year now, right? I honestly think he'll be fine. What about you, Richard? Asbel, are you absolutely sure about this? I am. Wow. All right. The decision is made. We rest tonight and head out first thing in the morning. Sounds like a plan. Captain Malik Man. So, wow. Very heavy stuff this episode. Uh, okay? Asbel having to decide to basically let himself die, potentially. You know, he's, he's always put his life in his friend's hands, but this is a whole new level of trust against someone that probably shouldn't be trusted, to be honest. You need to find a way to set their minds at ease. Once we board the shuttle, we can't afford any last-minute regrets. Understand? Yeah, we need to talk to Sophie. Good lord. Asbel, if you turned into Lambda, 
I'd have to resume my mission. That's not gonna happen. He's different from before. I know it's hard, but you just have to trust him. That was not the best way to set her mind at ease, to be honest. Well, let's just suck it up. Trust Lambda. Okay. And with that, um... Oh, hey, cool. I like that thing. So... Yep, with that, I'll go ahead and end the episode. Next time, we will go around, try and reassure people, and then head over to probably the core. Oh, I may go and see if I can find anything else to do, because the core seems like it may be like the end of the expansion of the game. So, yep. Um, I will see you all next time for more Let's Play Tales of Graces F. Until then, have a good day, and I'm sorry for my little audio warbles. That's really annoying. I, I don't usually watch the entirety of the episode. I usually just, like, hit each individual section to make sure it worked, because usually the mic works. <laughs> if it's going to break, it usually breaks, you know, when I start recording. So, but this time it actually just, like, went out. And Oh, hey, there's more stuff. You're more foolish than I thought, if you're willing to entrust me with your body. Once I take over, that which you call Asbel will cease to exist. Do you think you can return whole from such an ordeal? Oh, of course. I'm amazing. Yes, because I believe in you. On what basis? You don't need a basis to believe in someone. But if I had to give reasons, it's because you went out of your way to protect us. Also, you could have taken me over a dozen times by now, right? But you haven't. That's why. How so because you're not foolish. evil, that clearly means you're good. Besides... I'm only lending you my body. And things that are borrowed must always be returned. Pa, do not lecture me like some mewling human child. Oh, hey, it's Loki. It's got nothing to do with being human. It's about doing the right thing. And besides... You and I are sharing this body, remember? We need to watch each other's backs in order to keep things running smoothly. The word fool fits no one better <laughs> than the likes of you. A man who trusts anyone based on nothing more than his own flawed reason. You humans continue to amaze. But I also see now that foolishness is a deeper trait than I once believed. That's interesting. I don't quite Thanks, know what Linda. it means, but it's interesting. I think. I accept your proposal. I will borrow your body and absorb the core's elif. But be warned, notable strain will still remain on your body afterwards. You had best prepare yourself. All right, I'll do it. You got yourself a deal. Got it. Thanks for all the help, Lambda. All right, and with that, I will end the episode. Sorry, I forgot that little scene was there. Well, maybe not. How long, how long does this go? Wow. <laughs> hey, Sophie. Can't sleep? I was just going to visit the others. Want to come? Okay. All right, then. Well, let's go. She's the one you really need to talk to, Asbel. 
But no, I'm already five minutes over. I am not visiting the others in this episode. Next time, we will see them. We will talk to them. We will set their minds at ease, and everything will be amazing. See you then, guys.